Welcome back to my channel, we've got some breaking news in the world of Windows operating systems that you won't want to miss. If you're a Windows user or planning to upgrade your system, you're in the right place. Hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell, so you stay up to date with the latest tech news. Now, let's dive into today's headline. Did you think you could upgrade to Windows 11 for free using your trusty old Windows 7 or 8 license key? Well, think again. Microsoft has officially closed the door on that free installation path. So, what's the scoop? Let's break it down. Microsoft made it crystal clear on its device partner blog that they're no longer allowing users to activate Windows 11 with activation keys from Windows 7 or 8. This move comes as no surprise since Microsoft has been tightening its grip on Windows 11 activations. Finally, Microsoft has patched the loophole and older activation codes no longer work. That means if you want to experience the latest and greatest Microsoft OS on your custom PC build, you'll have to purchase a new license. And here's the kicker, just a month ago, Microsoft confirmed that the free installation path for Windows 11 using Windows 7 8 activation keys was ending. But, hold on, there's a silver lining for some folks. If your PC is currently running on Windows 10 and meets all the hardware requirements, you can still upgrade to Windows 11 for free. Now, if you've already converted your Windows 7 or 8 activation code into a digital key, you should be able to activate Windows 11 without any issues. Lucky you. But, here's the deal, this won't affect a lot of people. Most new laptops these days come preloaded with Windows 11. However, if you're one of those enthusiasts planning to build a custom PC and activate Windows 11 without shelling out for a new license, well, you're out of luck. To make things even more interesting, Microsoft is rumored to be working on the next iteration of its operating system, Windows 12. The buzz is that it's expected to debut in the first half of 2024 and might follow a subscription model. So, it looks like the tech world is in for some big changes. And there you have it, the latest scoop on Windows 11 activation using those trusty old Windows 7 and 8 license keys. Don't forget to like this video, leave your thoughts in the comments below, and hit that subscribe button for more tech news and updates. Thanks for joining us today, and we'll catch you in the next video. Stay techy!